Yeah, roots that are deep, that are anchored. You have a family, you're an author, you've had three books published. The Burning Ones. Yeah. <laughs> you're a burning one. Oh, yeah. But I'm connecting with the passion within you and the emotion. There's been a fear for me of passion because I haven't felt safe with this emotion. I haven't felt safe with this passion. I haven't felt safe because when those things were happening to me as a child, I wasn't safe. Yeah, yeah. Safety is so vital. There is safety, isn't there, yeah. in, in emotion. Yeah. There is safety in passion. There is safety in force. Yeah. Because you're a force to be reckoned with. Why are you here on this planet, Steve Oppel, and what is your future? What is the most that you can attain? Yeah. What is the greatest that you can be? for God. These are thoughts that have been running through my mind, especially over the last couple of months, like really going through. I turned 40, so I'm thinking through what am I here for? I want to hear what he has to say and I want to do it. And so whether the church becomes big or small doesn't really matter. Whether people want to hear me or don't want to hear me doesn't really matter. But the safety and the love and the joy and the... I get on a plane and as we're leaving Johannesburg, the pilot says, we we're about to pass through some turbulence. It's been a lightning storm, but I've never experienced turbulence like that. The plane did go, and there was a few people screaming yeah. and a few people crying. No. And I just went quiet. And in my own heart, I said, Lord, I thank you that my life is in your hands. Nobody loves me like you love me. And if you want me out of this earth, you'll take me. If you want me to stay, I'll stay. So I've got nothing to fear. And I was in total peace. My body's calm, I'm at rest. Yeah. We come through and it's all good. It doesn't come from any emotion. It comes from the reality of walking with my Heavenly Father, knowing that He loves me. Most mornings when I get up and I go down to have time with Him, I actually do this. I say, Father, I'm here. I'm your favorite one. I'm the one you delight in. I know that's a bit cheeky. No, no. I say, I'm your favorite I one. I love you. And I pray that as I read your word today, and I spend time in prayer with you today, meet with me change me, set my heart on fire, open up your word to me. That reality, if I can live in that all the days of my life, yeah. I've succeeded.